this is actually how it looks like before workout. I am such a princess. <laughs> all right, princess behavior, <laughs> all done. Actually that, so welcome back to a new video. And if you're new, please subscribe to the channel. I really appreciate that. And if you're new, maybe you don't even know what my name is and that I'm all this principessa kind of vibe. I'm not. I just have the best freaking man in the world who always wants to take care of me. And he wanted me to have a good session, so he took care of my arm. What can I say, men? You out there, if you take care of your lady, she will take care of you. So that's, it's teamwork. That's all it's all about. So yeah, today, shoulder workout. I'm ready. Let's get to goals. Let's make this happen. Final stretch. Final stretch. Honestly, I don't even know why I said that. It's not the final stretch for me because I'm going to continue doing what I've been doing. Uh, so yeah, let's just keep on doing whatever we're doing. But it's going to be the final stretch of these eight weeks of every day upload a video. So I just want to hear a little bit of feedback from you guys. What have you enjoyed? And what have you maybe not liked so much with this little cutting series, kind of daily vlog kind of type of vibe? Yeah, let me know down in the comments below. Yeah, we're rolling, baby. Yeah, we're here. We're doing uh, machine ladder races as exercise number one. We have done one set, and I need to have at least one or two more of these before I start to wake up. And then I'm gonna do three working sets of a little bit heavier, but yeah, let's go. I, do you think the pump will be good? Uh, I hope so. It feels already like one set in. Good. I feel like it's it's awakening. It's happening. A little bit of a pasta in the shoulders. That's good. Yeah. And that bread was amazing. Yeah, that was crazy. Yeah. So when I'm doing this, I'm really thinking about like almost moving these pads with my elbows. And just keeping my hands as like, yeah. Just cool. hanging there. Yeah, they're just hanging out. And the more you can control on the way down, the more you will actually benefit from this machine. It's not only you working on the way up, it's actually you working when you're controlling the weight on the way down. Houston, we have understood our problem today. But I'm actually not that terribly tired, but we just realized that it's daylight, daylight saving, or the other way around. We lost an hour. We lost an hour. Uh, we slept an hour less. Yeah. And honestly, I'm not feeling that bad, but... Cameraman does. Cameraman is very slow, and I like, I need to record this, because otherwise we will not have a video today, which he will be like sleeping when he's editing. Yeah. Will you? <laughs> no, no, no. But okay. um, we are, set. yes, we are into the working sets of the shoulder press. And this is actually one of my favorite shoulder presses. It's really smooth. I just realized that. Yeah. Uh, that one and the drop off machine that we have on Yon Reed, mm -hmm. which we also have here. Yeah. Oh, we do. Yeah. Huh. We need to show them it's that. It's a little bit cranky in here, though, because it's been. It's been uh, Overused. Yeah. But we need to show them that. The drop off thing? Yeah, yeah. Our friends from Sweden is here. They are just. Yeah. Right there. Yeah, talking do, food. Talking food, because that's what we do between the sets. Oh, oh. Let's go. Oh, nice. All right, uh, two more of those really good rounds, and uh, I think that's going to be it for this machine. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm, I'm actually very, really sweaty, um, and I think that is because of the amazing pasta. And you can put that here because I filmed it. Yeah. Like, yeah. It was actually really good, handmade pasta. It was super delicious, uh, and I feel like that is really keeping the fuel going here right now. Uh, and we wanted to show our friends this regime, so we thought, why not do it ourselves as well? So uh, I'm on my third. Yeah. Third set. Are you sweaty? Yeah. <laughs> um, third set, and uh, I feel like I'm a little bit stronger than my neck. 
Maybe we should start to do the neck machine. Maybe we're lacking strength in our necks. Might be that. Yeah. Uh, but I'm feeling strong, actually. Yeah, you are strong. right now. Stupid pump. Stupid. Step from the side again. On the other side. There. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah? Approved? Approved. Comment down below if it's approved. Uh, I got some pump. Yeah. Uh, See that? I also got some trapper pump. Uh, been lifting very heavy presses today and I feel like I need to release some tension in my neck, <laughs> in my trap. But anyways, we are doing dumbbell ladder races together with dumbbell front races. So first, oh, oh good. Come on. <sighs> And then yes. Come on. Oh my god. Let's go. Oh. Good set. That last one was hardly a pro a pro a pro a You have no idea, people. That hurts so bad in the best of fucking ways. Oops. Oops. I ain't gonna lie. Both of us has a gnarly pump. Like, re Tanya, once a day. No, once a week. A refeed is spot on. We are doing um, face pulls, seated face pulls um, in a back machine, back whatever i cannot speak anymore people it's been a long time since we ate and i'm really feeling it almost like i'm shaking when i'm holding it but you guys can see right there that he's pulling exactly with the rare delt come on you got it yep let's go so easy come on yes and as you all know, we want to have a full round shoulder, which will give that 3D effect. Show them the 3D effect. Yes, so full and round. Lovely, yeah. lovely. Because the thing is, in this one, I cannot go too high, too high, too heavy, because I need to sit over here because this was the only available rope. So you got to do what you got to do. Oh. 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 Mamma mia. That felt so good. Right there. Yes. Also one, we have one more uh, for the rare dolls. We're going to try to get a pec deck. Last bang. Last bang? <laughs> okay, I don't know where you are at, but I'm at the gym. I don't bang here. 
<laughs> Anyways, uh, we're doing the last little piece of this workout, and that's going to be reverse pec deck. This is one of my favorites for rare delts. Yeah. There's no other machine that makes me feel the rare delt as much as this one. I agree. And when I get to the cardio, I'm going to talk a little bit about what I do the day after a treat day. Because I know that many of you ask me what I change, what I do, and if I do all the cardio and stuff on top of my normal regimen. Stay tuned, this will be nasty good. So I'm going to do 10 bilateral and then I'm going to do 10 single arm and I'm going to decrease the weight and I'm going to decrease the weight. Yep. <clears throat> I don't know if that was 10, but I guess it was. I said I will catch you on the treadmill okay so what I want to talk about is gonna be this I don't change jack shit after a day of a refeed the only thing I'm thinking of is hydrating myself even more so or like really tuning into my amount of water otherwise I don't cut out carbs I don't eat less I don't do more cardio I'm just doing exactly what is supposed to in my schedule. And I do highly recommend you to do the same because the thing is, you cannot say that you're going to have a refeed day and then quote unquote, tell yourself that you did a wrongdoing. That is not like, then you don't reap the benefits at all from actually fueling your body a little bit more. So what I'm going to do now is just 20 minutes, steady state cardio. That's what's up, like left on my schedule. And then I'm going to go home. I'm going to eat my normal ground turkey and rice, as you guys always see that I eat. Uh, and yeah, and then I will just go grab my coffee and work. That's pretty much how the rest of the day is going to look like. And I have already taken one walk, so my steps, my step count will be hit whenever I've done these 20 minutes, I reckon. Maybe a little bit more, so maybe I will do another walk. But that's still going to just be inside of the realm of what I always do. So the extra calories that I got in last night are extra. We do not substitute it and I'm not freaking out about it. Will I have a little bit of water retention tomorrow and Tuesday? Probably, but that's also because I also got an IV therapy yesterday and I have seen myself always get a little bit filled with water after that. But on top of that, I did have more carbs than I'm usually having, which is totally fine. But you also have to remember that if you eat something more than you normally eat, your body will retain a little bit of water, but it's not fat. It's not going to stay there forever. But that being said, I hope that clarifies how I believe a refeed should be, how you should think about when you do a refeed and when you're not. God, have you guys even seen me? I'm sorry for the darkness. But with that said, see you guys tomorrow with the final results of the IB Fit Habit Challenge, and I'm super excited. Uh, and thank you for joining in today and yeah, don't forget to subscribe. All the best.